everyone. Marlene with Snow Gardener 307. So I had some requests. Some of you guys were disappointed I didn't try out the pins and didn't flip through this. And just so you guys know, Fred is still alive. He's looking okay. And then I also want to show you guys what I've done so far with my Happy Planner. It's not much, but I did get some setup. So first, let's go ahead and test these pins out. First of all, I have to tell you guys something. There are only 19 pins here. They're supposed to be 20. I went back and watched the video even when I undid the package of them. And there was only 19 then. So apparently I'm missing a pin. I have no idea what color. I don't know if I'm going to bother worrying about it, honestly. Because, you know, it's one of those things that's kind of too late. The packaging is gone. But 19 colors is what we've got. So uh, let's try these out. Okay, so here are the colors we have. And of course, I just named them. So you can name them whatever you want. So we've got light orange, orange, light pink, dark pink, red. I called this one wine. Dark purple, purple, light purple, dark blue, light blue, teal, light green, green, dark green, brown, gray, black, and smoke. So that shows you all the colors. Now let's make sure there are only 19 and that I'm not miscounting. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. Okay. I counted them a couple times, and then, like I told you guys, I even went and watched my video. So, I do like the parkour. I can't talk anymore. You guys know that every video. I like the parkour, um, obviously, because I'm running them out of ink. But I will have to see what color I'm missing. I wonder if it's more of a yellow color. Because this was the end. So, when they were packed, these ones were on this end, and this is the end that was open. So, I will have to check that out. All right. So, we've got Fred there. We've got the Wellness Happy Planner. I had, like I said, people request to flip through this because it's hard to see it on the website. The reason why I got this one is because it is an undated planner. Um, I like all the colors. Let's see, let's take this off. And right there it says, Just Breathe, and it's got rose gold. So let me lift that up so you guys can see that a little bit better. I'm sorry for my ring light. If I didn't have my ring light, you guys wouldn't be able to see me at all because, of course, you guys know I film these at all hours of the day and it is 3 o'clock in the morning. So, no natural light. So, as we open it up, the inside of the dashboard, 
has got lines of multiple colors, mainly purples and greens and teals. Then, of course, we've got the welcome. We've also got the stickers. And these are also in the rose gold. And you've got two for each month. Then it says, your life is as good as your mindset. The Happy Planner Wellness Edition. Plan a happy life. You can write your name there. Um, it says, be kind to yourself. It says, for one month, I will work on, let me scoot this up so you guys can see this. Then it says, holidays and birthdays, how I'm strengthening my mind, how I'm strengthening my body, and how I'm loving, what I'm loving about myself. Then this one right here says, give yourself the same care and attention that you give to others and watch yourself bloom. And it's got some flowers. And that is the purples and the blues and the teals. Then we've got a calendar. Up here it says top self-care priorities. And it's got one through four. Then we go into the weekly spread. And so we've got Monday through Sunday. It says intention, nourish, movement, and take note. And so each day has a different take note. On Monday it says reflection. Tuesday says today was, Wednesday says thankful for, Thursday says focusing on, Friday says looking inward, Saturday says daily gratitude, and Sunday says joy of today. And then over here on the side, you've got some lines and you've got a dot grid with noted. Let's see, I think these are all going to be the same. Yes, so the same thing all through these. You've got lots of pages. Okay, and then we go to the beginning of the next month. And it is exactly as it was in the beginning. And so this one says, live with intention. We've got pinks and peaches and rose gold on that. The monthly spread looks exactly the same. As do the weekly pages. So, yep, these all look the same. This dashboard page looks the same. This month says mindfulness, being present without judgment in every movement. Then we've got the same stuff. Let's just make sure these all look the same. Yes, they do. And we've got the same dashboard. This one says you make your own magic. And then it's got the crystals. I'm just flipping through these to make sure they're exactly the same. Then this one says, spend a little time with yourself to reflect and be grateful. This one's got a lot. Let's see what it says. So it says, do, stay positive, show gratitude, Love you and others. Take time to refresh and be gentle with yourself. This is in rose gold, just so you guys know. So if you can't see it, I apologize. It says, don't compare yourself to others. Ever think you are alone? Forget to relax and rest. Try to be perfect. Stop loving you. Oh, I really, I love these sayings in here. All right. So, yep, undated still. This one has got more of, I think that's still rose gold, but it's hard to tell on the yellow. It might be, let me get it out of there. I can't tell. It's too dark. I'm sorry, guys. I can't tell. I think it's rose gold, but with that yellow behind it, it almost looks gold. So this says reflect, I'm sorry, relax, refresh, reconnect. And yep, we've got the same layouts here. Then this one says, the most important project you'll ever work on is you. This one says, reminder, you are beautiful, you are magical, you are capable, you are wonderful. And then it says, okay. And then it says, yes, in bold. So that is your reminder for that one. And that's a peach color, just so you know. Yep, these are all still looking the same. Oh, there's a gratitude jar on this one. I like this one. It's super cute. It's a minty teal color. It says, 
take time for thanks. Create a gratitude jar. Write one thing you are grateful for each day. Place it in the jar. And then it's got a cute little picture of a jar. Yep, same thing again. And then on the purple, we've got you are allowed to be both a masterpiece and a work in progress simultaneously. And that quote is by Sophia Bush. <laughs> I like this one. It's all about balance. For those of you guys that don't know why I giggled like that, of course I giggle all the time. But my word for the year this year is balance. And so um, if you haven't checked out my video with that, I will link it up in the card here where I talk about my goals. I talk about why my word is balance and I go through a little bit about my personal life. So it's all about balance. Then let's see what we've got here. Same thing. Okay. And then at the very back, we've got a note page is what we've got. And then of course the back of it has the same lines and it's just got these colors here. So that is the wellness planner, undated vertical layout. And I believe this is the classic, but you guys know I'm brand new. This is the first planners I've ever had or happy planners I've ever had. So I, I was asked to go through that, asked to go through the pins. So that is done. And now I want to show you guys this one. And of course, there's that ring glide again. But for those of you guys that didn't see this, this is a memory planner. Um, so on the back, it says happy memory keeping. But I want to show you guys the quote here, if we can get it with the light. So it says, and suddenly, you know, it's time to start something new and trust the magic of new beginnings. Or I'm sorry, magic of beginnings. And that's by Meister Eckhart. And I, I'm a gardener, just so you guys know. So whenever the weather is good enough in Wyoming, you'll probably see some gardening on my channel. But let me show you what I have done. So we open up and um, I just put Sn Snow Gardener 307 in here because I plan on using this for my YouTube channel um, as well as my budgeting and everything. So I'm kind of putting all of this stuff together. Then I went ahead. This was an undated planner as well. So I'm starting in February because I got it in February. So I went ahead and labeled February, March, April, and May. And I did move the stickers. So if they look like they're coming off, it's my fault because I had them the other way first. And then I realized when I got into the other stuff that I wanted them to match. So I moved them. Um, but I do have two. So if I have to, I can replace them. So February, March, April, and May. And then I've got some other stuff in the back. Now, I haven't done a lot. I will tell you guys this. Um, I have dated my February calendar and I have made myself a goal over here to set YouTube filming schedule. I've done a little bit of decorating, but nothing crazy. I've written in the dates and today is now the 15th and I set, started setting it up on the 12th. I really haven't touched it the past two days, but I wanted to show you guys this. Then I went into my week. And I just picked some of the stickers I already had and just decorated a little bit. It's not perfect. It's not really full. I don't want it to be really full of stickers yet um, because I want to have plenty of room to write my YouTube schedule, what I want to do each day. And of course, this is a memory planner, so it's got places for pictures, stuff like that. I don't know if I'm going to use it for that. I bought this one because it was an undated and it was on sale, honestly, you guys. And then I did, so I did two weeks is what I did. And I did the other one in pink and this one in purple because I just love purple. And so I used some of the new stickers that I got. Then this one has like a dashboard where it talks about monthly milestones, favorite moments, memorable quote. I haven't filled any of that in yet. We'll see what I'm going to do. And then we jump into March. Just so you know, I haven't done anything here. I've got March and then I've got April. And I've got May in here. And that is how many months I have in here for planning. Then I threw in the sticky notes that I got. So sticky notes. Then I threw in my budget mom. And so these are my budget mom inserts. So my budget by paycheck workbook. And you'll see a little Erin Condren paperclip right there. 
And so I've got these kind of paper clipped because this is already done. So I've got January in there, but it's already done. And we're on February now. And I like keeping my month, at least one month previous in there. And so we've got February. These right here to you guys, these are from Erin Condren. And I plan on reusing these pages each year. Then of course we go into what you guys have already seen. We go into my calendar that I was actively working on. We go into my paycheck bill tracker. And of course this one was huge. You guys can see I've got notes all over. I definitely use it. I have not went and checked my bank account to make sure everything has cleared yet because some of this stuff won't clear quite yet, but I need to start checking that to make sure everything has cleared. Then we've got my cash breakdown and my debt payment plan. And then we have got, we have got my expense trackers. Now I don't show those on YouTube. You might've just saw a little bit. There's nothing too secretive, but I don't want you guys knowing my exact bank account balances, you know, just one of those things. Then we've got my husband's paycheck bill tracker for February 11th and his cash envelope breakdown. And then we have, I'm not going to show you all of that. We've got the rough draft of February and um, I do put his income, projected income on here. And of course, like I told you guys, he doesn't want that shared. He's okay with me sharing the total. And then I've got a blank one to fill out. So I print two of those for each one. Then I've got his debt payment, and then we go into March. And you can see I've already got my March highlighted. Let's see. My March is actually my February 26th payday. So you can see I haven't done a lot there, but I've got some bills down. I've made a note that I have to pay Amazon $3.48. And then I've got rough drafts for my husband, which I won't show you the other side of because it does have projected pay on there. Paycheck bill tracker, cash envelope breakdowns, and you'll see expense trackers, debt payment plans. So I keep everything in here. And then I've got April as well. I have not done anything with April yet, but it is in here and ready for when I need it. Then the next section is a personal section. So I'm not going to show you guys that. It's got some personal information in there that I won't divulge on YouTube. So let me go ahead and flip that one. And then this one is my savings challenges. So I'm doing two savings challenges right now. The first one that I'm doing is the Saveopoly, which you guys um, see me doing. And we should do Saveopoly now. That's weird. My watch says it's February 14th. It is February 14th. I told you guys it was the 15th. It's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. Because I was going to say, the 15th, we have to roll. We should roll, but that's tomorrow. Today is only Sunday. I lose track of things, you know, when it's so early in the morning. So Saveopoly got this from Mother Me and I. Um, it does print in color. And when I get my new printer, which is on the list, then I will probably reprint this in color. Then after my Saveopoly, I have got my... Penny Piggy Challenge. Now, this is a PDF that I made up. And so I changed it a little bit. It is on my Etsy shop. It, that and one other thing is on there, and that's it. I'm only charging a dollar for these. And I have to tell you guys, I made my first passive income from it. 54 cents. Yep, I made 54 cents this last month. Aren't you guys proud of me? Hey, 54 cents is better than nothing. And I created this for me because I wanted to do it. So just so you know, the one that is online does not say 2021 because I wanted whoever bought it to be able to use it over and over and over. And so after 52 weeks, you will have 6,000, 6,000, 6, I wish 6,000, $667.95. It's not a big savings challenge, but it is a savings challenge. And so this is the one where you start a penny a day and then you double it and you keep going, 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 going. And so the way that I do this, the reason why my piggies are different colors, for those of you guys that haven't watched it, I get paid once a month and I like to budget for this. So I pick four piggies for the month. So in January, they were pink. So these four piggies were pink in January. Then in February, they were blue. So these four piggies were from February. And when we go to March, I'll pick another four piggies. And I budget for this in my budget. All right. And then I've just got some budget mom extras. I print extra stuff just in case I need it. Because like I said, I don't have a printer at home. So I've got some more April stuff, a little bit of March stuff, a little bit of February stuff. 
And then at the very back right now, I've just got some paper. So I've got this paper here, and then I've also got a little bit of the colored paper. So I've got all the things, brain dump, notes, and be productive. So I've got that in there. So this is what my happy planner looks like so far. I'm excited. I've just put it together. I haven't worked with it yet, so I don't know if it's going to work. But I can tell you this. I'm loving these rings because they actually flip. For those of you guys that don't know and haven't watched, what I'm currently using for my budgeting, besides the Budget Mom, is I currently use an Erin Condren planner. And so this time, instead of going with the coiled, I went with the planner. But my problem here is I can't move them fast enough. And so in here, um, I just keep six months in here too, just so you guys know. Um, I've got January through June in here, and I've got all my stickers that I need at the back. And, well, that's not that. I have Sarah Marie stickers right here. Not open yet. These are for March. And so, you know, I'm ready, but I haven't even opened them. So by the time I open them, I'm not going to remember. <laughs> so this is what, see, look at, I already, like, I just flipped these pages. They were in and they have jumped track, jumped track on me. I love the Erin Condren style. I love using my expense trackers from Sarah Marie. And so I, I love the concept of it. I wish that the pages worked better. I wish for the money that you paid that the pages would actually stay in there. And so if I keep doing both the budget mom in my happy planner and doing an Erin Condren next year, or maybe even when they do the mid year, I am going to change because I really don't like this. You guys, I really, really don't. Um, but I love the pages of the Erin Condren. I love the dashboard. I love the stickers that I've done and been able to set up. I need you guys to send some well wishes for Fred. He's looking okay. And for those of you guys that are good with succulents inside, in all seriousness, uh, let me know what I should be doing. Uh-oh. So look at Fred over here. He's already got a leaf that is dying. See it? It's dying. Oh, no. Give me some help with Fred. All right, guys. Till I see you next time. I hope you have a blessed day. Thanks, you guys. For those of you guys that have stayed this long and... I will see you guys the next time. Bye.